Huh? JJ, what's that noise? You didn't hear anything? It sounds like something incredibly large and dangerous is approaching us. Ah! Oh! Mikey, look! It's a huge bloop in El Gran Maja. Aren't you scared? Whoa! This is so cool, for real! So you weren't scared of them? Unexpected! Yep, yep, yep! Maybe we can tame them. What do you think? Guys, look! It's a huge bloop in El Gran Maja. We should try to tame them. What are we going to use to tame them? Do we have anything to tame them with? Mikey, let's go inside and get some emeralds and diamonds. Emeralds for emerald bloop, and I'll take diamonds for diamond El Gran Maja. And I don't remember where we might have had emeralds and diamonds. Do you even remember? Right here in the chests above the beds. But I think there are only four diamonds in there. So take the dirt too. First, we will try to tame them with the dirt. And only then, we will try to use the emeralds and diamonds. That's all we have? Why so little? We never have emeralds and diamonds in large quantities. Mikey, but you don't bring anything into the house yourself. You can't complain. Besides, it's lucky to have Bloop and El Gran Maja here. Hey, El Gran Maja, you want some dirt? Don't like it, don't you? Well, look, I've got diamonds. You're very silly if you think four diamond blocks are enough to tame him. That's all I've got, El Gran Maja. I hope you won't take offense. Wait, don't swim away, monster. I'll find more diamond blocks for you. <laughs> Wait, we'll go and rob the village for you. Yep, yep, yep. <laughs> hey, Mikey. Wait, go feed your bloop, El Gran Maja, my beast. Oh, come on. Hey, Bloop, take the dirt from me. I, I don't think he likes your dirt. So we still have to go to the village to find lots of diamonds and emeralds there. Yep, yep, yep. Okay, let's go. Hmm, I know where to go. Here we are at the nearest village to us. Mikey, we need somewhere to find a huge amount of diamonds and emeralds for our Bloop and El Gran Maja. Who's going to look for emeralds and who's going to look for diamonds? Or are we going to go together to look for it all? Wait, Mikey. Oh, there's a forge. I wonder what's in it. Oh, there's a villager. Oh, villager, give us some diamonds. It's time to share with us. Let's catch him and rob him. I don't think he's going to give us the diamonds for nothing. Hey, where are you going? Give us more diamonds. Mikey, I think he's getting away from us. But okay, let's not try to catch up with him because we still have emeralds to find. So we'll put the diamond search on hold for now. <laughs> Mikey, why are you crying? We'd better find you some emeralds now, but we need to think how we can get into the forge when the villager goes out. Oh, there's an emerald shop. I think the villager who works there is calling us. Maybe you could try asking him. For free, of course. Yep, yep, yep. Hey, you. Give us all the emeralds you've got. Mikey, come on. You can't be rude to strangers like that. It could end badly for you. Mikey, I told you. Okay, guys, I have a plan that will get us some much-needed emeralds. What did you come up with? Am I gonna get hit again? Mikey, you think I'm trying to hurt you again, but I don't. I only want to help you. Here, come here. There's a chest. You'll need to get the loot out of there. When the villager turns away, I'll still try to distract him. Hey, look, there's a star flying over there. Just kidding. There's enough for two giant bloops. I'm sure of it. Why don't we find you a second bloop and then we won't have to find diamonds for El Gran Majo. Okay, villager. We're not going to buy anything from you. We only have one diamond. All right, let's go buy. Mikey and I are going. Oh, look. He sold you one emerald block for your diamond. You have to take it back. Oh, Mikey, you're right. We should definitely get that. Now we need to step back and talk in private. So, how much were you able to steal from him? Show me! I hope it's a lot! This is all I've got! Look at this! Wow, Mikey, that's sure enough for your bloop. Now we need to figure out how we can sneak into the forge, for there are even diamond block floors. We can easily take them with us. That's for sure! Huge bloop and El Gran Majo will be happy and we can tame them easily! So, Mikey, we need to get a sneak peek at that nasty and greedy diamond villager, just so he doesn't see us. Mikey, careful! Can't you hear me? Be careful! Oops! I think something very important is hidden where he is standing now. Mikey, we have to wait until he's gone to see what's in there. Huh? What's he hiding in there, JJ? Let's take a look at it! 
Yeah, sure. Let him go about his business first, and then we'll take a look at that spot he's been standing on for so long. I'm sure he's got something hidden there. It's terrible how deep he decided to bury his treasure. Whoa! There's the chest, Mikey. Wow! Yeah! It's the lever from the door of his house. Oh, great. Now we can definitely get in there and steal. I mean, borrow all his diamonds. Great, Mikey. Let's go to his house. Let's see how many diamonds he's decided to hide from us. <laughs> so, Diamond Villager, are you ready to get a lot poorer? Sure you are, since you left your backpack in plain sight for us. Let's go, Mikey. Let's take everything from this greedy guy. Whoa, what a lot of stuff he has stored here. This is awesome. Mikey, we're taking everything, and that's the end of it. Everything, everything for us, everything for my new pet. Come on, Mikey, give me everything you took out of that chest. Ouch! I'll give it to you. I'll give it to you. But please don't hit me. You won't even share with me. That's better. Mikey, come on. Give me everything in your pockets. You're not gonna need it anyway. Your emerald bloop will only eat emeralds. And I'm actually sharing with you. I've shared emeralds with you when you needed them. So share my diamonds with me. I have another idea on how we can rob this nasty villager. Let's just take his cool diamond floor off of him. Ouch! I'll do it. And you'll just keep watch until that nasty villager comes back. Okay, Mikey. What do you think you're doing? Sleeping here? No. Go and make sure the diamond villager doesn't come back. Come on, Mikey, get up. Well, never mind. If he wants to sleep, let him sleep. The main thing is to dig up as much as we can before the owner of this incredibly rich dwelling suddenly decides to come back. Otherwise, our business is definitely bad. Whoa, now! What are you doing in my house, you disgusting thieves? Give me back my diamonds and get out of here. Shame on you for stealing from an elderly villager. What a disgusting generation. Give me back my diamonds. Give back my treasure. And get out of here. Hey! What a great trick we played on him. Mikey, the smoke grenade idea was awesome. You're welcome. The important thing is that this unpleasant person is off our backs and we can safely go feed our new pets. Where are you, Mikey? Come on, why do I have to wait for you? Hurry up and catch up with me, or I'll tame the two monsters of the deep myself. No, let's go together. Why are you doing everything without me as usual? Okay. Hey, Bloop. Hey, Elmaha. How are you doing? I know it's great because we brought you a bunch of yummy emeralds and diamonds. So come on, everybody. Enjoy your meal. What do you think? You like it? It's great. So now we'll be friends. That's great. Mikey, no offense, but it looks like my new pet's gonna be stronger than yours. That's right, El Maha. What do you think? Will you be stronger than Bloop? Yes, that's what I think. Hey, no, don't lie. Bloop will be stronger. We'll have a contest between them, and you and your monster will lose. Doubt! And you'll both cry sadly like little children. No, that's usually your prerogative. So let's not argue now and measure our strength and just ride our new pets and then we'll train them and then after training and clash them in a fair fight. All right, fine, I agree with you. And you monsters, do you agree? Yes, I think they agree. Wow! Whoa. <laughs> How cool! Thank you, Diamond L Grand Maja, for letting me ride you. Mikey, you okay? I see, you and Blob are having fun too. Uh -huh. This is just unbelievably cool. Totally agree. Hmm. What, I wonder, are Mikey and Emerald Blob doing there right now? Ha <laughs> ha! I see. I guess they're practicing mutual animosity. Hey, Mikey, what did you do to your giant fish that it threw you so hard? Just trying to introduce a little variety into its diet, but it refuses to eat anything I offer it. Huh? Of course Blob won't eat everything. It's not your garbage can after all. Stop pushing garbage into it, Mikey. Spare the giant fish. See, Blob says no, it won't have flowers. Does it look like a flower bed? You're putting flowers in it? No, Mikey, stop it. That's animal abuse. How about I decide what I'm going to feed my monster of the deep? Hey! <laughs> Just don't poison your monster. Otherwise, who will you send to fight my El Grande Maja? I'm gonna win this one myself, so just leave me alone. Can't you see? We're practicing, and you're interrupting it. Why don't you eat something? Can't you see I need emeralds too? Because it's a giant emerald fish, not a regular cow. It doesn't need your stupid hay. Why don't you eat your own hay? If you think Blob can eat it too, 
Blob won't eat fish either. Oh, no, are you stupid now, Mikey? Give him some emeralds. Don't be stingy. All right, all right, you talked me into it. Okay, there, see? I'm getting the emeralds. So you'll leave me alone? You're all so mean. Ha-ha! <laughs> and that's better. Mikey finally figured out how to properly feed his giant fish. Isn't that good news? Yes, this is just great news. Animal rights activists rejoice. Well, Blob, you seem to be having fun, so we can continue our workout. Come on, jump, Blob, jump. Jumping is good for your health. If you jump, you'll be healthier. Awesome. Mikey has finally started training his Blob. Let's see how fast he gets bored of it. No! And Blob turned out to be a pretty good jumper. That's really cool. But Mikey's not much of a jumper. I'll go and ask what's wrong. Blob must be pleased with how well he pushed Mikey. I'm happy about that too. Hey Mikey, what's the sand taste like these days? Ow! That sounded hurtful, JJ. Yeah, yeah, that's what I figured. That's it, come on, good luck. I'm off to my deep sea monster. See you at our competition. Or you can come by and watch me train my Grand Maha. Well, hello, my giant diamond friend. How are you doing? I'm sure you're feeling great, because I'm not Mikey, and I'm not going to feed you any garbage. I'm only going to feed you select diamonds. Speaking of diamonds, this time, you'll have to break those three emerald columns to get a new portion. Can you do it? Yeah, that's what I figured. Then come on, I need one swipe of your powerful tail. I'm sure you can do it, because you're a real deep sea monster. Come on, come on, the diamond blocks won't eat themselves. Hurry up! Well, that's just embarrassing. Come on, come on, let's see some power. I believe in you, my diamond L Grand Maha. Whoa! Okay, that was pretty good. Good job, you're really good. Shall we try it again? Of course, first you have to be treated to diamonds, and then we'll definitely try again. Otherwise, how come the Diamond El Gran Maha is not fed with diamonds? No way! Come on, eat up and get your strength back. I got an idea. We should get Mikey to come over and see how cool you are at breaking emerald blocks. Hey, Mikey, get over here. You're about to see something. Huh? What do you want to show me? What you've learned while I've been away? I want to show you how strong my El Gran Maha is. <laughs> come on, show it off. Now I'm getting creepy curious. I'm kidding. I don't care. Whoa! That's really cool! I totally agree! But that's not all! He also tells funny jokes! <laughs> oh, Mikey must have realized that his blob is no match for my El Gran Maha, so he's crying! Huh? Mikey, what are you doing? Stop! Or he'll just swallow you and eat you! Which he basically just did! Haha! <laughs> Serves you right, Mikey! Don't be so nasty and shoot anybody! You've got some nerve! Let me go and shoot your blob too! Let's see what you do then. Cry like a little girl. That's your favorite reaction to everything. What a great looking lump you turned out to be. El Maha, you are a good boy today. And you, Mikey, are a bad one. So I'm punishing you for life in diamond prison. Huh. I hope you admit all your fault and don't go around resenting it later. You decided to attack my new pet. So you deserve to be eaten, chewed up, spit out, and then walled up. Be thankful I'm not burying you in the dirt. Otherwise, it would be a total disgrace. <laughs> Here you go, they're emeralds. You were so greedy when you didn't want to give emeralds to your blob. So you can have mine too, especially since they won't help you in your situation anyway. All right, Mikey. The fight is about to begin. My diamond El Gran Maha versus your emerald blue. I'm curious to see who wins, but my money's on Maha. No. But my money's on Maja. And so the bloop starts attacking. He's firing his emeralds. JJ, personally, I think my favorite bloop will win. I'm betting on him. Come on, bloop, don't let me down, baby. Shoot him with your emeralds and dodge those damn diamonds. Come on, El Maha. Show this bloop who's the big man. That's a tough fight. Don't let me lose to this turtle. Whoa. Your bloop is dodging my favorite's tail very skillfully. I bet on the big green guy for a reason. Come on, El Maha. Get and destroy that bloop. My bloop dodges so skillfully. But my El Maha doesn't mind. He hits his tail so often that I don't think your fat bloop can keep up with him. He does. I 
think it's your Maha who needs to take it easy. Come on, Bloop. Give them a beating. Now, your Bloop attacked me. He heard you. Of course, JJ Bloop won't disappoint me. I'm sure of it. Something tells me you're wrong, Mikey. Look what's going on with Bloop. Oh, no, my Bloop. Oh, yeah. Well done, El Maha. You beat that green guy. Guys, my Diamond El Maha has defeated that pathetic Emerald Blue. I can only celebrate my victory over that turtle. How did that happen? I was pretty sure Bloop was gonna win. Come here, you good monster. You're literally the best. Here's your reward, Toothy. And you're a loser, Mikey. You should have accepted that Maha was cooler. All you have to do is look at my winner, El Grand Maha, and your loser, pathetic Bloop, who is now lying on his belly. There he is, lying there, loser and green like you. I'll remember that for you. Hey, El Grand Maha, you're a handsome man, you've got your reward. You beat that Bloop like I beat that little turtle. Why did I lose? It was so good. All right, Mikey, it was a good fight and all, but let's start saying goodbye to our dear viewers. El Grand Maha, you're a real tough monster. That's how we realize that diamonds are cooler than emeralds, that El Grand Maha is cooler than Bloop, and that I'm cooler than that turtle. I'm sad that Bloop lost. Next time I'll win some other competition. Okay, dear viewers, good luck and see you all again.